Hello to all my beautiful viewers out there. Today I'm going to be reviewing and unboxing the Supreme 1800 and Supreme Crashed Cop Car Hooded Sweatshirts that I bought from Waves Never Die. Okay, I didn't buy them because they were Supreme, okay? I bought them because I'm a sucker for embroidery, okay? I saw that there was amazing embroidery work on both the hoodies. And I wanted to give Supreme another chance because the only uh, time I've actually like got a Supreme hooded sweatshirt is the pre-owned one that I got from like 2017, like years ago. And that one has been washed by its previous owner like a hundred times. So it's super uncomfortable to wear. There's like no movement in it. It feels really hard to move in it. I'm hoping that this redeems it. A lot of people are saying, nah, Daniel, it's because you bought a large and you should have bought an extra large. That's debatable. I mean, Supreme, with the sizing for all the Australian viewers out there, if you've never bought a Supreme anything before, generally, size down one from your Australian size. Why? It's an American brand. It's going to be extra large when it doesn't need to be extra large. So, a large, like the uh, Supreme 2017 hoodie that I bought years ago, is a large, so technically it's an extra large. It's a little bit tight on me, but I can still wear it. It still looks nice. Same case for any Australian out there that's interested in getting Supreme and has never bought Supreme before. If you're planning on buying a hoodie or a shirt, make sure you buy it a size down. Or if you do want an oversized fit, go true to size. But I would say that they're very, very big for the sizing that they are. So don't, don't get used to the idea that the Australian size is going to coincide with the American Supreme size. They're totally different. And in today's unboxing, I bought the... 1800 um embroidered hoodie in an xl so that's going to be massive on me but i'm kind of keen to have that like drape over me and then i bought the crashed cop car one in a large so this will be the real test to see if i'm just too thick or too fat for a large this will be the test and yeah that's basically it i want to see how each of them fit an xl versus a large i am like six five a hundred and like 10 ish kilos so a large is maybe a little bit optimistic but we'll see we'll see after i unbox it we'll see if it's a bit optimistic or if a large is actually just a perfect fit and it's just because mine's been washed like a hundred times is the reason why my large doesn't fit me too well let's find out the only way to find out is unboxing this bad boy now i do just have to say waves or waves never die however you want to call the actual we uh, website it's called waves never die on their website but the actual like URL is Waves AU. So some people call it Waves, some people call it Waves Never Die. Either way, it's the same website. They are an amazing reseller of streetwear, more specifically Supreme, and I think I would say their other specialty is probably Bape. Supreme and Bape is probably their, their best things that they have there. They don't have a lot of anti-social social club, but I can imagine because that's hard to get in, especially in Australia. They were amazing. When it came to customer service, they were amazing. So I messaged the Instagram page as soon as I bought these because I was interested in seeing if they were going to get hoodies in that are coming out in December into their uh, in their stock. And they said that they would try. They said that they just got my order and that they were very thankful for it. They just replied like within five minutes of me sending the message, which is insane for customer service. Because I have bought from resellers before, like reselling businesses before. And it takes like days upon days to reply so waves never die props to you guys for replying like straight away it's your customer service is amazing it's really really well done but customer service aside i think it's time now to unbox your content the stuff that you're providing and see if that's up to scratch i i mean i have no doubts but you know we we got to see what's going on in this package so let's get into it guys Okay, I'll shut up now, I'll shut up and I'll open the box. I, I feel like I'm starting to fall into like the common YouTube trend of like talking for seven minutes in like a 10 minute unboxing video and then finally unboxing the box. So I'm going to shut up. I know I like to talk a lot. I'm going to shut up, open it up, see what's going on. Okay, so got that open, got that open. Ooh. Now, when I was, like, receiving this box, I was like, damn, this is a huge box for, like, two hoodies. But then, a lot of people were making comments when I said that. They were like, Daniel, your your hoodies are, like, the size of a bedspread. You're a big guy. It's going to be a big box. And I was like, ah, oh, okay, guys. So, 
you know, I'm just, maybe I'm self-conscious about my weight and you guys just made it a whole lot worse, but thanks anyway. <laughs> anyway, whoa, what do you know? First thing I gotta say upon opening it, I'll show you guys. Thank you, Waves Never Die, for providing the Supreme bag. I know a lot of people that like buying Supreme products love having the bag with them, so that's a plus. Thank you for that. Oh, thank God. Oh, Jesus. It's a big bag. It's a big goddamn bag. We'll put that bag over here. Okay. Okay. So. We got some stickers. We got... Oh, what stickers we got? We got... Liquid swords. Oh, that's a sick Supreme sticker. Okay. Dude, we got some... I love it that we got, like, different Supreme... I'm trying to get the other one. Or, like, get the other one. Actually, let's just open it. Screw it. Let's just open this. Okay. What stickers did we get? Okay. We got, sticker-wise, Iconic... <laughs> look at that. Ah! <laughs> okay. Iconic Supreme Box logo sticker. We then got... The Liquid Swords. Oh. <laughs> Liquid Swords sticker. I think that's a very cool sticker as well. We then got... Oh, I like this one. I don't know what that one's called. It says Supreme on it. We got that one as well. That's really cool. I'm glad that we got three stickers. Thank you. Thank you, Waves. Oh, and we can't forget the advertising. Waves never die. I feel like the actual contemporary art that Supreme's box logo is, like, copied off by doing that. You know? If you know what I mean, you know what I mean. Okay. Aw, oh, dude. How awesome is that? Thank you for shopping at Waves. Oh, you guys are Thank you for shopping at Waves. There you go. Lovely. Okay. Let's pull out these actual hoodies, though. Let's actually get these bad boys out. So. Oh, my God. Okay. They are kind of massive. We've got the 1-800. Oh, my God. This is massive. You ready for this? Woo. Jesus. I can't even fit myself on it. That's all embroidered, by the way. That's what I was, like, super, super keen on. This all here, that's all embroidered. Now. I don't know if I can show it in the video, but I'll put the box aside. Um, see these green specks on it? This green embroidery along here? All this stuff here is glow in the dark. So if I was to... T actually, I'm going to turn off my monitor and see if we can see it. No, you can't really see it. It's not in actual, like, full dark lighting. Damn it, my other monitor's keeping it all up. Okay, I was hoping that turning my monitor off would allow it to... Well, I'm pretty sure it's glow-in-the-dark anyway, but, yeah, unfortunately, you can't see it in this lighting. On the front, we've got it embroidered as well, 1-800-SUPREME, but it's the back that I'm mainly keen on. Like, look at that. That's crazy. That's all embroidered. I'm so, like, I love that. I think it's, I think the hands are embroidered, uh, sorry, a glow-in-the-dark there, because they look like they're out of that glow-in-the-dark green material, but I love it. Look at all that artwork on the back. That's absolutely sick. Okay, so, um, oh jeez, <laughs> oh god. Okay, um, let's have a look at the sizing. Oh, did I get the? Okay, one eight hundred. There we go. I will try this on now, and we'll see how it fits. We'll see how it goes. Okay, so straight away from putting this on, this already feels a thousand times better. Than, than the super washed supreme one that I have from way back, and the hoodie. If they feel like they've made the hoodies a lot larger in the um, in the 2019 collection, because the 2017 hoodie that feels kind of small. I don't know if it's because it's like a weird. It's a Thrasher collab. I have the um, the oh my god, my boyfriend can't skate Thrasher Supreme collab from 2017. I don't know if that one has something to do with the hoodie, but the hoodie on that one is seems kind of small. I don't know if it's because it's been washed like a thousand times. That it feels kind of small but this one it honestly feels a little bit bigger probably because it hasn't been washed yet and the fit is actually really nice it goes down right past my waist i think a large would work if you're an extra large even if you're six five at like a hundred something kilos you can do a large man like this is a large this fits really well it is a little bit fitted so it's not draping over the top of me it turns out i must have accidentally ordered the 1800 large instead of the extra large but that's okay this fit is totally fine. I'm absolutely fine with this fit. Goes down to exactly where it needs to go down to. Doesn't extend like the um, 
wrist doesn't go all the way down to here. Perfectly sits there. I think this fits really fine, man. I would say uh, extra large, you're, you're overcompensating if you're buying an extra large. I think a large is big enough. I don't think you need much bigger than that. I love the detailing on it, the detailing on the front, the detailing on the back. All insane. All insane. Absolutely love it. So, that's the 1800. Let's move on to the crashed cop car. See how that one feels. Okay, so, moving on to hoodie number two, which is the crashed cop car. This one, still in its plastic bag. Some people are super picky about that, saying they won't like touch a Supreme hoodie unless it's still in the plastic bag. Mainly because the fake market for Supreme is massive. Now, Waves Never Die actually gets their stuff directly from the Supreme Paris store. They obviously have like a plug over in Paris that they buy it from over there and then get it shipped over here. So, not too much drama. I looked at the retail price of the um, of the 1800 hoodie and according to the retail tag on it, it says that the retail price is 178, I think it's pounds. Which, goddamn, that's a lot of Australian dollars. Like, holy crap. And that's why, um, when you're buying Supreme, the resale is super high, because the retail for them, it's super high in general. So, fresh out of the bag, fresh out of there, we have... I love the detailing on this one as well. The Supreme Crashed Cop Car. All embroidered, nothing screen printed, that's... That's why I bought them, because I'm a massive sucker for the embroidery. I absolutely love that. And I don't think we have anything on the back. Yeah. Just a simple black hoodie on the back, nothing on the back. This one retailed for £168. I assume the French use pounds. I, I don't know. I don't know what they use. Currency-wise. I haven't bought anything from France, so I'm actually kind of ignorant when, that, when it comes to that. But the level of detail... On the front of this, that's crazy. Give me one moment to try it on and we'll see how it feels. It should feel exactly the same as the 1800, but we'll give it a shot. Let's give it a try. Again, quite another fitted hoodie, but heaps of room to move. Feels a thousand times better. I'm just going to keep saying it. it feels a thousand times better than my Supreme Thrasher hoodie, mainly because it hasn't been washed heaps. Um, I always notice with Supreme's hooded sweatshirts, the material is a lot different from just your standard wool hoodie, right? Like, it is a lot tougher. It feels a lot tougher. It feels like I could go skating in this, and if I fell over onto concrete, I feel like this wouldn't rip at all, because it's just, like, super sturdy. Again, a large, it's basically a perfect fit. You wouldn't want... You, I don't think you really ever need an XL. XL is one of the most popular sizes to sell out from the store as soon as a drop comes out. I was looking at the drop times of like the recent week. Extra large, always one of the first sizes to go. It's either extra large or small. One of the two. Super hard to cop either. But I'm super happy with this. I am super happy with the level of detail as I assumed that there would be on the hoodies. The quality is exactly what I expected, mainly because I already have a Supreme hoodie from before. And I gotta say, Waves, you done, you done did well. Okay, so, how would I review Waves? How would I look at it? Well, I got both hoodies that I ordered. One of them, I did just check my order confirmation. One of them is the incorrect size, the 1800 Supreme hoodie. The one that's apparent, allegedly glow in the dark and with all the detailing on the back. That was meant to be an extra large. I received a large. I reckon I'll just contact Waves about it and whatever the resolution is, I reckon I'll just chuck that in the description section below for whatever the outcome is. Instead of making a whole nother video about my beef with Waves, I'll just put it in the description section below. So if you guys want to find out how that's resolved, I'll put it in the description section. Uh, the quality. It's exactly what I expected. I got two Supreme hoodies. They feel exactly how a Supreme hoodie should feel. All the tags seem to be legit. It has the pricing tags on them. Basically brand new. Never worn. So exactly how I would want them. The shipping. I ordered it on... The, I got the order confirmation on the Tuesday. And it arrived yesterday on the Thursday. So it was two day shipping. Insane. That's pretty express if you ask me. Pricing, it'd be about what I expect from a retail, uh, uh, retail resale business. 
they have afterpay and stuff like that so you know it's not too hard you can do it in split payments pretty breezy pretty easy got a bunch of stickers for my order so I'm pretty happy with that I mean I didn't ask for stickers but they gave stickers so I'm pretty happy with that they gave a supreme bag which not a lot of retail reseller businesses do they usually just keep the bags so that's a plus I suppose shipping was free didn't have to pay for shipping so that's pretty breezy and yeah guys I, I honestly I'm pretty happy with it I mean some people would be super up in arms about getting the wrong size but a large fits me fine anyway so it's not like they sent me like a small or a medium because I wouldn't be able to fit in those at all I'm still really happy that I got a large honestly I'm not too bummed out about that I'll obviously message waves and be like oh you accidentally sent me a large what can we do about this um, again I'm not hugely fussed by it because a large fits me so if they say oh all our extra large is sold out and we can't resolve that we'll just send you like a discount on your next order or like whatever again not hugely fussed by it I'm not gonna start beef with waves I'm totally fine with receiving a large Larges fit me guys Jesus it's all right anyway I would say waves do pretty well apart from the order muck up but I like assume that's like a one in like 2000 like it I'm of course unluckily that one guy but I'm not hugely fussed by that so as I said it's okay I'll message waves but apart from that super happy with my order so if you want to buy a supreme for a resale price that's pretty reasonable and in Australia with free shipping I'm telling you waves is the place to go to and that's it guys that's me unboxing the two hoodies that I got the 1800 I'll just show it again the 1800 supreme hoodie all embroidered absolutely love that one and my one of my favorite ones from the fall winter collection I think I said it in my drip flip or skip of the fall winter supreme hooded sweatshirts if you haven't checked that out subscribe to the channel and go check out that supreme video uh yeah the destroyed cop car one i saw initially that waves were selling the gray one i think it was and i was like nah don't want it in gray want it in black man because this artwork this really stands out when it's in black i love it in black it's so sick okay well that's my experience with waves unfortunately i got the wrong size with one of my hoodies but the wrong size was my true two size so i'm not hugely fussed by that the size that i ordered was oversized i know that like heaps of other supreme youtubers and heaps of other youtubers in general would be up in arms saying wow i now have absolute beef with waves waves is trash and it, i mean i don't care i don't care it's not a huge problem they charge the exact same amount for each size fellas it's not it's not a huge problem anyway i'm really happy with it i don't really care too much i'll message waves about the incorrect sizing and see if anything happens of it if it does i'll mention it in the description section below if not doesn't hugely impact me i'd only be annoyed if they sent me like a small but they sent me my true to size so can't complain anyway guys i would love to hear your thoughts and opinions on the hoodies in the comment section below did you pick these up when these dropped like weeks ago which one are you a fan of are you a fan of the crashed cop car or are you more a fan of the 1800 embroidered one here which one are you more of a fan of do you like the crash cop car or 1800 I'm kind of swaying to the 1800 more because the detailing on that that's insane I love how it like shines as well the detailing on that is insane it's absolutely insane but my only beef is, is that this is on the back of the hoodie so if I wear like a single jacket over the top all the detailing is gone and the only thing I'm gonna have on the front is that <laughs> which is kind of depressing which is why I like this one a little bit more because if I wear a hoodie I uh, sorry a jacket over the top of this one it's still gonna have that beautiful artwork on the front and that's why I that's why I really like these two hoodies here these are probably the only hoodies that I'm gonna cop from this fall winter supreme season I might cop well I want to cop one of the uh, BOGOs. I want to cop one of the BOGOs that are allegedly dropping in December. And that's what I was contacting Waves about. To see if they were dropping those. I would love to cop one of those. Because they're going to sell for a lot. But also I like the design on... There's one with a purple box logo. I can't remember if it's the grey one or the black one. But it's an awesome design. The box logo is totally different from normal Supreme box logos. So I wouldn't mind picking one of them up. I had a pretty good experience with Waves. Which hoodie do you like? Let me know everything in the comment section below. Have you bought from Waves before? Any issues with buying from Waves before? I had a really good time. I'm not hugely fast. Either way, let me know all your thoughts and opinions in that comment section below. Don't forget, while you're going down to that comment section below to add that wonderful opinion of yours, don't forget to follow all these socials in the description section below. 
just so you stay up to date with everything that I'm posting, everything that I've got going on. And that's it guys, that is the Supreme 1800 uh, hoodie, the Supreme Crashed Cop Car hoodie. That's all I really got to say, so until next time, I'll catch you later.